Hello, I thought uh, it would be good to make an update um, on what's going on in my life. Uh, so, first of all, I got a haircut, so I no longer have a lot of hair. <laughs> um, I just, I was planning to, on growing more and more hair, but then I came to a point where I was like, hmm, I think that's too, too much hair. So I got a haircut and uh, so far I am really, really enjoying short hair. It's so much easier to, um, to have short hair than long hair. It's uh, definitely a little bit colder. Uh, it's not as warm whenever, like, it's not as warm um, in comparison to when I had more hair on my head. Like I can really feel wind <laughs> on my, uh, on the back of my head. Okay, so do you remember, um, so if you, if you watch some of the videos on my YouTube channel, you probably have seen the video of, with Cesar. Cesar was a person, um, was a man from Peru that I found in October while doing outreach. I approached him, we started to talk about Jesus. It turned out that he came, he came to the mall um, and he was actually thinking about talking about Jesus with somebody, okay? So I'm, I'm approaching this man and uh, I made a whole video about it, but I'll just uh, repeat myself really quick. Yeah, so I'm, we are at the mall. It's like October, in the middle of October, 2021. And I see this man and I just decided, okay, let me approach him. Let me ask him if there's anything I could pray for him. Let me share the gospel with him. So I approached him, we started to talk. Turns out that uh, God was actually telling him, uh, putting it on his heart to talk with somebody about Jesus. So we start talking. I take him with me, we go out for, you know, we keep going, like we go out to different people, approach them and um, uh, pray for them, share the gospel. And then uh, we connected more, we met up one more time. Then he came to the, uh, to the school campground, got to know other people. He got blessed um, and encouraged and motivated, got equipped and went back to, uh, to his country, to Peru. And now I'm going to Peru. Yay! Um, yeah, so that's the, that's the life update. Uh, in less than two weeks, I'm, um, I'm going to be in Peru. I'm going to fly to Peru, stay there for a couple of weeks. I'm going to help out with an event, um, with a kickstart. Um, so if you know anyone in Lima, Peru, or if you know basically anyone in Peru who is, uh, who, who is seeking God, who is maybe looking for some fellowship, for deliverance, healing, ministry, teaching, to hear the full gospel, any of those needs, um, definitely let me know. And uh, that's the, the very reason I'll be there in Peru, to share the gospel, to minister to people, to help with house fellowships, to do Bible studies, whatever is needed. If you have any sick people, would love to pray for them. If, if there are people who have depression, anxieties, uh, suffer from any mental things, we would love to pray for them, we would love to set them free. In Jesus Christ's name, we love to see people experience freedom and uh, the transformation in their lives. Um, so that's, that's the update. I'm going to Peru um, in less than two weeks. And it's uh, thanks to that person of peace, to that man that and that I met while doing outreach, just you know, approached a person, didn't really feel any specific leading. And hey, it turned out that we became friends and we are brothers in Christ. And now he is excited to invite us to his country and to share the same message, the same full gospel. And um, the, not only the full gospel, but also the, this life, life of a disciple, traveling and ministering to people, loving people and just, uh, just uh, making disciples. Okay, so that's the, that's the update. That's very, very exciting. I'll definitely keep you posted. I'll make some videos uh, from Peru and from the travel to Peru. And it's very exciting. I've never been to South America before. So that's going to be a uh, you know, stretching experience. I don't know that much Spanish. Um, so that's also going to be something to learn. You know, I'll, I'll, I'll be practicing Spanish, uh, learn new language. That's, um, that's some awesome, awesome, um, awesome adventure right there in front of me. Okay, so God bless you. And definitely let me know if you know anyone in Peru. Um, let me know and we'll get in touch. Okay, God bless you.